at night, and so he, he's going to track them down to Stalling City. So your prediction is that Nightwing will soon we'll be in the be cliffhanger on on Arrow. Yeah, I think I think I think Nightwing is going to show up on Arrow on the cliffhanger. All right. Wow, I, I could see that happening. You think they would um, incorporate Flash again, or no? They're leaving that alone for his own well, series. They, they did bring him up. Uh, they didn't. Uh, she, she did. She, Felicity did ask about uh, Barry, and uh, that's when those uh, two, um, I guess, scientists, whatever they were, told mm-hmm. told her that uh, he was still in the hospital, but that Iris was uh, with him, and Iris is uh, turns out to be Barry's wife in the future. Mm. So that that's kind of another. Uh, teaser there so they, they, they dropped a couple of teasers in there so Iris does end up with Barry oh yeah so, yeah uh, that's cool yeah I think I think it's actually kind of clever if they bring Nightwing and Flash on Arrow every once in a while or build it up because that would definitely work with the Super Friends or you know the Justice League or, yeah, some version of it. Yeah. yeah, that would definitely work because they got to figure out a way that these people are communicating and have some sort of. They can't spend a whole movie. Oh, I didn't know you existed. Oh, I didn't know you existed. You know. It's, but it's the whole thing the with series. The whole thing with Nightwing is though he is supposed to have been Batman's protege. Right. So this whole time, there's no mention of of Batman, right? Batman in, in the in the news anywhere where Green Arrow is? That's true. That's just a good point. So then, well, if they skip and bring up Nightwing, then all that history, you know, they'll probably make a mention. Oh, this is the guy that, you know, they'll probably throw it underneath the rug a little bit. Make it like a little quick mention. But there should be some sort of politician or someone saying all oh, these people running around with masks and they did do that about three or four shows ago remember they started saying that at the time when they first introduced the politician and you didn't oh, realize yeah. he was crooked right. yeah. yeah they did that around that time but then they haven't done that since which was yeah. uh, very interesting well yeah it would make sense because even in real life politicians don't want uh uh, vigilantes because uh, they can't control them. Right. You know, they'll paint them as bad as they want to, right. but just like in the old days of Robin Hood, the people will be behind the vigilante because they know the government's not doing anything. Right. You know, the vigilante would get support. Right. And uh,